Leiden, Dutch pronunciation, Le, D, N, listen, in English and archaic Dutch also Leiden is a city and municipality in the province of South Holland, Netherlands. The municipality of Leiden had a population of 123,856 in August 2017, but the city forms one densely connected agglomeration with its suburbs Oostgeest, Leiderdorp, Voorschoten and Zoderwoud with 206,647 inhabitants. The Netherlands Central Bureau of Statistics CBS further includes Katwijk in the agglomeration which makes the total population of the Leiden urban agglomeration 270,879, and in the larger Leiden urban area also Tailingen, Noordwijk, and Noordwijkerhout are included within total 348,868 inhabitants. Leiden is located on the Oude Rien, at a distance of some 20 km 12 miles from The Hague to its south and some 40 km 25 miles from Amsterdam to its north. The recreational area of the Kaag Lakes Kagerplassen lies just to the northeast of Leiden. A university city since 1575, Leiden has been one of Europe's most prominent scientific centres for more than four centuries. Leiden is a typical university city. University buildings are scattered throughout the city, and the many students from all over the world give the city a bustling, vivid, and international atmosphere. Many important scientific discoveries have been made here, giving rise to Leiden's motto, City of Discoveries. The city houses Leiden University, the oldest university of the Netherlands, and Leiden University Medical Center. Leiden University is one of Europe's top universities, with 13 Nobel Prize winners. It is a member of the League of European Research Universities and positioned highly in all international academic rankings. It is twinned with Oxford, the location of the United Kingdom's oldest university. Leiden University and Leiden University of Applied Sciences Leidse Hogeschool together have around 35,000 students. Modern scientific medical research and teaching started in the early 18th century in Leiden with Borhoff. Leiden is a city with a rich cultural heritage, not only in science, but also in the arts. One of the world's most famous painters, Rembrandt, was born and educated in Leiden. Other famous Leiden painters include Lucas van Leiden, Jan van Goyen and Jan Steen. History Leiden was formed on an artificial hill today called the Birched van Leiden at the confluence of the rivers Oud and New Rien Old and New Rhine. In the oldest reference to this, from circa 860, the settlement was called Lethon. The name is said to be from Germanic asterisk Letha, canal, in dative pluralis, thus meaning, at the canals. Canal is actually not the completely proper word. A Letha later, lead was a human-modified natural river, partly natural, partly artificial. Leiden has in the past erroneously been associated with the Roman outpost Lugdunum Batavorum. This particular castellum was thought to be located at the Birched of Leiden, and the city's name was thought to be derived from the Latin name Lugdunum. However the castellum was in fact closer to the town of Catwake, whereas the Roman settlement near modern-day Leiden was called Matillo. The landlord of Leiden, situated in a stronghold on the hill Mott, was initially subject to the Bishop of Utrecht but around 1100 the Burgraves became subject to the County of Holland. This county got its name in 1101 from a domain near the stronghold, Holtland or Holland. Leiden was sacked in 1047 by Emperor Henry III. Early 13th century, Ada, Countess of Holland took refuge here when she was fighting in a civil war against her uncle, William I, Count of Holland. He besieged the stronghold and captured Ada. Leiden received city rights in 1266. In 1389, its population had grown to about 4,000 persons. Topic. Siege of 1420 In 1420, during the Hook and Cod Wars, Duke John III of Bavaria along with his army marched from Gouda in the direction of Leiden in order to conquer the city since Leiden did not pay the new Count of Holland Jacqueline, Countess of Hainaut, his niece and only daughter of Count William VI of Holland. Burgrave Phillips of Wassenaar and the other local noblemen of the Hook faction assumed that the Duke would besiege Leiden first and send small units out to conquer the surrounding citadels. But John of Bavaria chose to attack the citadels first. He rolled the cannons along with his army but one which was too heavy went by ship. By firing at the walls and gates with iron balls the citadels fell one by one. 
Within a week John of Bavaria conquered the castles of Polgeist, Terdes, Hoikmade, De Zigil, Ter Waerd, Wormond and De Pattenpool. On 24 June the army appeared before the walls of Leiden. On 17 August 1420, after a two-month siege the city surrendered to John of Bavaria. The burgrave Philips of Wassenaar was stripped of his offices and rights and lived out his last years in captivity. 16th to 18th centuries Leiden flourished in the 16th and 17th century. At the close of the 15th century the weaving establishments mainly broadcloth of Leiden were very important, and after the expulsion of the Spaniards Leiden cloth, Leiden bays and Leiden camlet were familiar terms. In the same period, Leiden developed an important printing and publishing industry. The influential printer Christoffel Planten lived there at one time. One of his pupils was Lodewijk Elsevier (1547–1617), who established the largest bookshop and printing works in Leiden. A business continued by his descendants through 1712, and the name subsequently adopted in a variant spelling by contemporary publisher Elsevier. In 1572, the city sided with the Dutch revolt against Spanish rule and played an important role in the Eighty Years' War. Besieged from May until October 1574 by the Spanish, Leiden was relieved by the cutting of the dikes, thus enabling ships to carry provisions to the inhabitants of the flooded town. As a reward for the heroic defence of the previous year, the University of Leiden was founded by William I of Orange in 1575. Yearly on 3 October, the end of the siege is still celebrated in Leiden. Tradition tells that the citizens were offered the choice between a university and a certain exemption from taxes and chose the university. The siege is notable also for being the first instance in Europe of the issuance of paper money, with paper taken from prayer books being stamped using coin dies when silver ran out. Leiden is also known as the place where the pilgrims as well as some of the first settlers of New Amsterdam lived and operated a printing press for a time in the early 17th century before their departure to Massachusetts and New Amsterdam in the New World. In the 17th century, Leiden prospered, in part because of the impetus to the textile industry by refugees from Flanders. While the city had lost about a third of its 15,000 citizens during the siege of 1574, it quickly recovered to 45,000 inhabitants in 1622, and may have come near to 70,000 circa 1670. During the Dutch Golden Era, Leiden was the second largest city of Holland, after Amsterdam, particularly due to the work by Hermann Boerhaave (1668–1738). It played a crucial role in the establishment of modern chemistry and medicine. From the late 17th century onwards Leiden slumped, mainly due to the decline of the cloth industries. In the beginning of the 19th century the baize manufacture was altogether given up, although industry remained central to Leiden economy. This decline is painted vividly by the fall in population. The population of Leiden had sunk to 30,000 between 1796 and 1811, and in 1904 was 56,044. From the 17th to the early 19th century, Leiden was the publishing place of one of the most important contemporary journals, Nouvelles Extraordinaires de Divers Androids, known also as Gazette de Laide. Topic: 19th and 20th centuries. On 12 January 1807, a catastrophe struck the city when a boat loaded with 17,400 kilograms pounds of gunpowder blew up in the middle of Leiden, 151 persons were killed, over 2,000 were injured and some 220 homes were destroyed. King Louis Bonaparte personally visited the city to provide assistance to the victims. Although located in the center of the city, the area destroyed remained empty for many years. In 1886, the space was turned into a public park, the Van der Werf Park. In 1842, the railroad from Leiden to Harlem was inaugurated, and one year later, the railway to Den Haag was completed, resulting in some social and economic improvement. Perhaps the most important piece of Dutch history contributed by Leiden was the Constitution of the Netherlands. Johan Rudolf Thorbeck (1798–1872) wrote the Dutch Constitution in April 1848 in his house at Gerenmark 9 in Leiden. Leiden's reputation as the city of books continued through the 19th century with the establishment of publishing dynasties by Evert Jan Bril and Albertus Willem Sijetoff. 
Sijetov, who rose to prominence in the trade of translated books, wrote a letter in 1899 to Queen Wilhelmina regarding his opposition to becoming a signatory to the Berne Convention for the Protection of Literary and Artistic Works. He felt that international copyright restrictions would stifle the Dutch publishing industry. Leiden began to expand beyond its 17th century moats around 1896 and the number of citizens surpassed 50,000 in 1900. After 1920, new industries were established in the city, such as the canning and metal industries. During World War II, Leiden was hit hard by Allied bombardments. The areas surrounding the railway station and Maravake were almost completely destroyed. Leiden today The city's biggest and most popular annual festival is celebrated at 3 October and is called simply 3 October. The people of Leiden celebrate the end of the Spanish siege of 1574. It typically takes place over the course of two to three days usually two but three if there's a Sunday involved and includes parades, a hutspot feast, historical reenactments, a funfair and other events. The city has recently started to host the Leiden International Film Festival, the fastest growing festival of its type in the Netherlands. Leiden has important functions as a shopping and trade centre for communities around the city. The University of Leiden is famous for its many discoveries, including Snell's Law by Willebrod Snellius. The famous Leiden jar, a capacitor made from a glass jar, invented in Leiden by Peter van Mischenbroek in 1746. Another development was in cryogenics. Hey K. Kamerling Onnes, 1913 Nobel Prize winner in physics, liquefied helium for the first time, 1908, and later managed to reach a temperature of less than one degree above the absolute minimum. Albert Einstein also spent some time at Leiden University during his early to middle career. The city also houses the Eurotransplant, the international organization responsible for the mediation and allocation of organ donation procedures in Austria, Belgium, Croatia, Germany, Luxembourg, the Netherlands and Slovenia. Leiden also houses the headquarters of Airbus, a global pan-European aerospace and defence corporation and a leading defence and military contractor worldwide. The group includes Airbus, the leading manufacturer of commercial aircraft worldwide. Topic. Rivers, canals and parks The two branches of the Oude Rien, which enter Leiden on the east, unite in the centre of the city. The city is further intersected by numerous small canals with tree-bordered quays. On the west side of the city, the Hortus Botanicus and other gardens extend along the old single, or outer canal. The Leidse Hout Park, which contains a small deer park, lies on the northwest border with Oostgeest. The Van der Werf Park is named after the mayor Peter Adriaans, Van der Werf, who defended the city against the Spaniards in 1574. The city was beleaguered for months and many died from famine. The open space for the park was formed by the accidental explosion of a ship loaded with gunpowder in 1807, which destroyed hundreds of houses, including that of the Elsevier family of printers. Topic. Buildings of interest Because of the economic decline from the end of the 17th until the middle of the 19th century, much of the 16th and 17th century city centre is still intact. It is the second largest 17th century town centre in the Netherlands, the largest being Amsterdam's city centre. A hundred buildings in the centre are decorated with large murals of poetry, part of a wall poem project active from 1992, and still ongoing. Topic. Fortifications At the strategically important junction of the two arms of the Oud Rien stands the old Castle de Birched, a circular tower built on an earthen mound. The mound probably was a refuge against high water before a small wooden fortress was built on top of it in the 11th century. The citadel is a so-called Mott and Bailey castle. Of Leiden's old city gates only two are left, the Zeilport and the Moorsport, both dating from the end of the 17th century. Apart from one small watch tower on the single nothing is left of the town's city walls. Another former fortification is the Gravenstein. Built as a fortress in the 13th century it has since served as house, library and prison. Presently it is one of the university's buildings. <laughs> Churches 
The chief of Leiden's numerous churches are the Huglense Kirk or the Church of St Pancras, built in the 15th century and containing a monument to Peter Adrian's van der Werf and the Peterskirk Church of St Peter 1315 with monuments to Scaliger, Borhov and other famous scholars. From a historical perspective the Marakirk is interesting too. Arendt van S. Gravesand designed that church in 1639. Other fine examples of his work in Leiden are in the Stedelijk Museum de Lakenhall, the Municipal Museum of Fine Arts, and the Bibliotheca Thysiana. The growing city needed another church, and the Marakirk was the first Protestant church to be built in Leiden and in Holland after the Reformation. It is an example of Dutch classicism. In the drawings by Van S. Gravesand, the pulpit is the centerpiece of the church. The pulpit is modeled after the one in the New Kirk at Harlem, designed by Jacob van Kampen. The building was first used in 1650, and is still in use. The Heilige Lodewekirk is first Catholic church in Leiden that was built after the Reformation. This church was given to the Catholics after the gunpowder explosion in 1807, which killed 150 inhabitants and destroyed a large part of the city centre. The Walskirk 63 was originally part of the Katerina Hospital. In 1584 it became the Church of Protestant Refugees from the Southern Netherlands Brugge and France. Later churches in the centre include the St. Joseph in Expressionistic style. <laughs> <laughs> University buildings The city centre contains many buildings that are in use by the University of Leiden. The Academy building is housed in a former 16th century convent. Among the institutions connected with the university are the National Institution for East Indian Languages, Ethnology and Geography, the Botanical Gardens, founded in 1587, the Observatory 1860, the Museum of Antiquities Rijksmuseum van Oudheden, and the Ethnographical Museum, of which P. F. von Siebold's Japanese collection was the nucleus Rijksmuseum voor Volkenkunde. This collection is now housed in a separate museum called the Sieboldhuis. The Bibliotheca Thysiana occupies an old Renaissance building of the year 1655. It is especially rich in legal works and vernacular chronicles. Noteworthy are also the many special collections at Leiden University Library among which those of the Society of Dutch Literature 1766 and the collection of casts and engravings. In recent years the university has built the Leiden Bioscience Park at the city's outskirts to accommodate the science departments. Other buildings Status City Hall, a 16th-century building that was badly damaged by a fire in 1929 but has its Renaissance façade designed by Leven de Key still standing Gemilinches van Rijnland 1596, restored in 1878 De Waag Wayhouse in Dutch, built by Peter Post Gravenstein, a former 15th century jail at the Gerich Square, former courthouse. Stedelijk Gymnasium, aka Latin School, the old gymnasium, 1599. Stadstimmerwerf, the city carpenter's yard and wharf, 1612, both built by Levin de Key, c. 1560 to 1627. Heilige Gerist Wieschus, a former Holy Spirit orphanage, a complex of 16th century buildings. Molen de Vock, a corn grinding windmill, now home to a museum. 1743. Pest House, which was built during 1657 1661 at that time just outside the city for curing patients suffering the bubonic plague. However, after it was built, the feared disease did not occur in the Netherlands anymore, so it was never used for its original purpose. The building has been used as a military hospital, prison, national asylum, and army museum. It now serves as the entrance of Naturalis, one of the largest natural history museums in the world. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Public transport. Bus transport in Leiden is provided by Arriva railway stations within the municipality of Leiden are Leiden Central, Leiden Lamanchens, De Winkeleden is on the planned route of the Rheingulen, the Netherlands' first light rail project. This project has, however been shelved for the foreseeable time. Notable inhabitants See also People from Leiden following is a selection of important Leidenaren throughout history 
William II, 1228 to 1256, Count of Holland, later also King of Germany. Peter Blomavena, 1466 to 1546, Carthusian author. Cornelius Engelbrechtschoon, 1468 to 1533, painter. Lucas van Leiden, 1494 to 1533, engraver and painter. John of Leiden, 1509 to 1536, leader of the Anabaptist Munster Rebellion. Charles de Lacluse, 1526 to 1609, botanist, director of Leiden's Hortus Botanicus, where his cultivation of tulips led to the Dutch tulip industry. Ludolf van Sulen, 1540 to 1610, mathematician, computed pi. William Brewster, 1567 to 1644, pilgrim. Willibrod Snell, 1580 to 1626, astronomer and mathematician. William Bradford, 1590 to 1657, pilgrim, leader of the American Plymouth Colony in Massachusetts. Jan van Goyen, 1596 to 1656, painter. Rembrandt van Rien, 1606 to 1669, painter. Love Brewster, 1611-1650 over 1, pilgrim. Franz Post, 1612 to 1680, painter. Gerard Doe, 1613 to 1675, painter. Peter de Ring, CA 1615 to 1660, painter. Jan Steen, 1626 to 1679, painter. Hendrik van der Burra, 1627 after 1664, painter. Gabriel Metsu, 1629 to 1667, painter. Hermann Borhov, 1668 to 1738, humanist and physician. Johann Bockström, 1688 to 1742, writer, scientist and Lutheran theologian. Bernhard Siegfried Albinus, 1697 to 1770, anatomist. Gottfried van Swieten, 1733 to 1803, diplomat, friendship and collaboration with several great composers. Philip Franz Bathasser von Siebold, 1796–1866, physician, collector, Japanologist. Johannes de Durek van der Waals, 1837–1923, physicist. Jan Elias Kickert, 1843–1925, watercolorist. Hendrik Lorentz, 1853–1928, physicist. Heike Kamerling Onnes, 1853–1926, physicist. Willem Einthoven, 1860–1927, physician, physiologist. Peter Zeeman, 1865–1943, physicist. Willem de Sitter, 1872–1934, mathematician, physicist, astronomer. Albert Einstein, 1879–1955, lecturer, researcher at Leiden University, various dates between 1916 and 1930. Paul Ehrenfest, 1880–1933, physicist. Theo van Dusburg, 1883–1931, painter, architect, writer. Jan Hendrik Oort, 1900–1992, astronomer. Marinus van der Lubbe, 1909–1934, accused of setting fire to the Reichstag in Berlin. Hendrik Casimir, 1909–2000, physicist. Nina Folk, 1924–2008, actress, acting teacher. Juke de Vries, 1960, professor at Leiden University and runner-up candidate for the PVDA elections in 2002 lost to Wouter Boss. Armin van Buren, 1976, producer, DJ, DJ Magazine's No. 1 DJ 2007–2010 and 2012. Carice van Houten, 1976, singer and film, television actress Gegard Mousasi, 1985, kickboxer and mixed martial artist Dairo, 1992, producer, DJ, DJ Magazine's No. 30 DJ 2013, No. 27 DJ 2014 and 2015 and No. 93 DJ 2016. Bert Poes Bleder, 2011-2013, cat covered by national media for his exploits around the city. Topic international relations Topic Twin cities, sister cities Leiden is twinned with, Juigalpa, Nicaragua Krefeld, Germany Oxford, United Kingdom Torin, Poland Buffalo City, South Africa Nagasaki, Japan Topic Miscellaneous The coat of arms of Leiden is two red keys, crossed in an X shape on a white background. 
These keys are the keys of heaven held by St. Peter, for whom a large church in the city centre is named. Because of this coat of arms, Leiden is referred to as the Sludelstad, the key city. For a time Leiden held the title the coldest place on earth because of the developments in cryogenics in a laboratory there. Heike Kamerling Onnes 1913 Nobel Prize winner in physics liquefied helium for the first time 1908, and later managed to reach a temperature of less than one degree above absolute zero. The Norwegian cheese key cheese is named after the keys in coat of arms of Leiden, as it is a variation of Leiden cheese. The following places and things are named after this city Leiden, New York, USA Leiden, Massachusetts, USA Leiden High School District 212 in Franklin Park, Illinois, USA Leiden Scale, for measuring extreme low temperatures Factor V Leiden is named after the city of Leiden where it was discovered in 1994. The Leiden jar, a capacitor made from a glass jar, was invented here by Peter van Mischenbroek in 1746. It was actually first invented by Ewald Georg von Kleist the year before, but the name, Leiden jar, stuck. Leiden's status town hall has a poem in the form of a cryptogram on its facade that records the date 1574 in Roman numerals, the year of the Black Famine, or Spanish Siege w equals two verses. Dutch. When the Black Famine had brought to the death nearly six thousand persons, then God the Lord repented, and gave bread again as much as we could wish. Sports. Zorg N. Zekerheide Leiden is the basketball club of Leiden. In 2011 and 2013 they won the national title, in 2010 and 2012 the National Cup and in 2011 and 2012 the National Super Cup. The club also played in the FIBA Eurochallenge and reached the second round best 16 in 2011-2012. See also Leiden Classical A Distributed Computing Project OUDT Leiden, former Michelin-starred restaurant Wireless Leiden References Citations Sources See also Bibliography of the History of Leiden Lawrence, Pete, Lucasen, Jan. 1997. Inwanertellen van Nederlandse Steden CA. 1300 to 1800. Amsterdam, Neha. ISBN 9057420082. Topic: External links. Official website Scenic video Leiden Sludelstad Leiden City of Keys time lapse